This was my Facebook post on uh, the other day. Christmas is still up at my house. I'm thinking Saturday's rain day is the day to take it down. Well, the last I counted, there were at least 100 comments oh, about okay. this. Yeah. All right, so including a few coworkers, little Ben Briscoe said, same, I'm ready to have my house back. Lauren Coleman said, same here, my tree is still up. And Carol said, this weekend, the Christmas stuff comes down, the Valentine's stuff oh, goes wow. up. Okay. okay. Well, to continue on with what some other folks said, Marion said, worst day. <laughs> Day of the year I hate it. I guess because you know all the shine and the sparkle, it's going to go away. Yeah. Darlene is with me. She says, yes, this weekend is a good time. That's my plan as well. Caroline pointed out, you know, Saturday, January 6th is Epiphany, the last oh, day of Christmas. Yeah. So I guess it's, you know, good to be taking yeah. it down tomorrow. And then my friend Katie made it real, real. Her Christmas decor came down December 26th. Wow. She was like, wow. boom, Get it gone. done. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Finished. Well, thankfully, Christmas I don't dinner. have a lot to do. So I wish Same. all of you all who are go doing all of that the absolute best. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> it is the worst. It takes like all day. Yeah. And think about it. Day. Some people, including people who work here or have in the past, will leave it up for many months, like yes, into April. Yeah, oh. I think they take the Christmas ornaments oh, down though, right? And they put it other ornaments yeah, or they just it. make it like mm -hmm. a natural tree with yeah. lights. I mean, some people like love the Christmas season so much that you just have yeah. it for four or five months. Up. Are you thinking? I got a question that, for yes. you too. Since this is something you guys are going to be doing tomorrow. Uh -huh. Will We're you play down. some Christmas music while oh, you're no. doing this? No. Oh, no. no? no. It is out. Done. Nope. See you later. Bye. Why not? The 26th, it was over. No, okay. Got That's what's in <laughs> music after the 26th, and I don't even mind movies after the 26th, but by this time, I'm like, get it out of Get my it house. out of there. Yeah. <laughs> the biggest thing for me, too, you say it takes forever, and it really, like, I agree. I feel that wholeheartedly because I have to organize everything. Right. I just put away, like, all these wall hangings because I put up Christmas wall hangings. I have to take down, I have to climb this massive ladder to get on this, like, cool little porch ledge thing. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. I have to do all of that. I have to take this really heavy vase and put it up top. I gotta tell you what. <laughs> It's so much work. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. okay. Well, I'll just give me a coffee. Wow. All right. Do you want to help? I mean, I, I, mean, I think you're going to need to take her for support tomorrow. Admittedly, I still have like little like decorative pumpkins out. No, so. I was going to say, I have like a movie. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Call me out. Like a display in the table. All right. I do okay. have this little, small, little tree, and all I have to do is unplug it and put it up. And after that, I'm going to watch you some tea. I think you should unplug it, put it up, and you're going to then text Hunter and be like, whew, I, I am know. toast. I was you know, I might text Hunter and say, hey, I'll come over and are I'll you, help you out. Are you okay? Mm. All right. Well, just yesterday, I talked to the city of Greensboro recycling folks. In case you're thinking to yourself, I need to get rid of the real tree that's in my house, or maybe you're like, I'm done with this fake tree, yeah. like done, done mm -hmm. with yeah. it. What do you do? Here are the rules for pickup. You want to make sure to take off all the ornaments, the bows, the ribbons. Whoop, that one's stuck. Um, just so that either they don't end up as debris or litter. And if it's a real tree, it's going to be taken to be composted. So we want to make sure those things stay out of the compost. So we want bare trees out on the curb. For our real trees, we want to make sure that they're less than five feet long. So if it's too long, if you've got a really big tree, cut it in half if it's over five feet. And then for our artificial trees, donate them if you can. So if there's an option to take them to a donation center or to give it to somebody else who might want it next year, do that first before you put them out.